everyone, thank you all so much for stopping by the channel today and welcome back to this brand new video. Now in today's video I'm going to show you part 2 of how to obtain all of the festive beer hats. The latest video I showed you how to get the first 5 one. Now this is basically part 2 on how to get all of the other 6 ones. So if you haven't watched it, the latest video, it will be on the top right of the screen, how to get the first five. So now let's get started with the last six of these beer hats. Now, first of all, I'm going to be showing you, of course, the tutorial on how to do this. And we're going to do this using gender swap. Now with gender swap, I always suggest you to do this on a new or fresh account or else you will have the risk of losing your character, possibly your cars, your outfits, your apartments, your money, everything. So I highly recommend you to do this on a new account um, and just unlock all of the gender swap items on there. Now, if you have a new account where you can do this on, you can just do the gender swap glitch on and on if you do it correctly, and then you can unlock all of the items like that. So on screen right here, I'm showing you um, the items that we are getting today. We're going to start off with the blue snowflake beer hat, which is on the right of the screen. In the middle, we have the red holly beer hat. And on left, we have this Pisswasser festive beer hat. And then for the next batch, we have the lemon festive beer hat, the green festive beer hat, and the red snowflake beer hat. Now, um, I will leave all of the um, components for that in the pinned comments so you can decide for yourself which one that you want to get. Now, without further talking, let's get straight into the tutorial. Now, we're going to start off by going over to the archive router. The download link will be in the description box down below. And you want to connect both of your consoles to the archive router. Now, if you have them connected, then you should both see them show up inside of the program. From here, you want to go over to your console number one. Just click on the little gaming icon and then onto the lock. And then you should now notice that you can lock the console that you're doing this on. Now, since I'm doing it on the PlayStation 5, I'm going to be using the button on the right. So just use the one which applies to your console. Now, as soon as it's looking like this, then you can now go over to your console number one and just load up GTA 5. Now, in here, you can go over to an invite-only session, and then you should have two characters inside of your account. Now, we're going to be doing this on the mail, so make sure that you have at least one mail character created to where you want your beer hats on. Now what you're going to do is you're going to wait like a solid five minutes in this session. And if you have waited in this session, you can now go over to your console number two. In here, just load up GTA 5 and as well go over to an invite only session. Now in this session, you're also going to wait a solid five minutes to make sure that none of your consoles will get locked out of the Wi-Fi. And if you have that, then you can now proceed with the glitch. So on console number two, you want to open up your pause menu, go to the online tab and in here go over to manage characters. Now what we're going to do is we're going to be deleting the male character where we want the beer hats on. Now you should notice that these are the same clips from the video previously on, but I will show you um, how this works. It's basically the exact same method. Now what you're going to do is you're going to be deleting that mail character, which is on the right of my section. Go ahead and do that. And as soon as you have it deleted, we're now going to be creating a new character and we're going to make it a female. Now keep in mind that this whole process that we're doing on console number two or console number one should be in that online session with the mail character. So if you have that selected and you have, have you made it a female, you're going to hit the save and continue, give it a name and just take it into an online session. Now, as soon as you are in this session, I suggest you to go in passive mode because you will be in a public session and just go over to the clothing store. Now in here, we're going to be purchasing the components in order to get these six beer heads. Now we're going to start off with this first top right here, which is the charcoal palms reefer color. Now this one will give you the lemon festive beer hat. Next we have the pink palms reefer color, and that will give you the green festive beer hat. 
Then we have the cool sunset, which gives you the red snowflake beer heads. Then we have the warm sunset river color, which gives you the blue snowflake beer hats. Then we have the green pineapple, which gives you the red holly beer hats. And then the scarlet pineapple, which gives you the Pisswasser festive beer hats. Now, as soon as you have all of these items purchased, then you can now trigger a save icon. Now, what you're going to do is you're just going to put on some accessories or take off some accessories. You should have a yellow save. Now, after the yellow save, you can go over to story mode and then we are done on console number two. So then back over to console number one, which is still our male character, still in that same online session. What you're going to do is you're going to purchase some ammo and this will make sure that your money sticks. Next, you want to trigger a wanted level. So you shoot someone and if you have that wanted level, you want to get rid of it. Now, this will make sure that your ranking will save on your character. Now, if you have that last step, we'll be going over to the clothing store and you want to purchase any type of clothing. And then you want to trigger another yellow save icon on your mail as well. I just do the same steps, so just apply some accessories and take them off. And if your save icon goes away, you can as well go over to story mode with your male character. Now, as soon as we are in story mode, we're first of all going back to the archive router. And in here, you want to click on the button that makes sure that you get lagged out. So we're basically going to be removing the lag at this point. As soon as it is all set back to normal, then you will get locked out of your console. But don't worry, you can just accept it and just go back to GTA 5. So if you're back at GTA 5, you can now go back over to a invite only session. And then you should now load in with like a male character with a female hat on it. That's when you know your gender swap went correctly. Now, don't worry, of course, you can just change your whole character using the change appearance section. So you will not keep this female hat. So then I'm going over to the Binko clothing store to show you the beer hats that we have just unlocked and that we have just glitched. So right here, I'm going to be starting off with the first one that we have unlocked, which is the Pisswasser festive beer hats. And this is what it looks like. Then we have the red holly beer hats, and next we have the blue snowflake. Then we have the red snowflake, the green festive beer hats, and the last item will be this lemon festive beer hats. So this is what the six of them look like. The other five are included in the other video. So this was um, the tutorial basically on how to get these six rare beer hats. Now, since they are unlocked, you will keep them forever. I hope you guys liked today's video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And of course, I hope to see you back in the next video. Bye everyone.